He's forced to pop into Flicker a bit. Well, it is very even, actually, when we're talking about the talent prediction by Axe for game two, because I believe Evo's Legends might actually have the better draft. It all depends back down to that execution, right? Yeah, Evo's does. Legends also need to wait for level four for Taz to have more pressure pressure in the game. But Keyboy here already bursted down, taken down, and just zoned away. Retribution as well. It's going to be the first blood picked up by Boots. As he comes in, Keyboy actually flickered with and for the clear. You can see now on Esports still leading with a 1,000 gold lead. Citizen looking to invade the jungle from on Esports as Sans still very easily taking those minions down. Will be able to rotate faster. Taz needs to be careful though. 20 seconds left on the next turtle. Taz oh, guided to safety. Beautiful read by both Keyboy and Kyrie. Over, knowing that the guiding win is going to be esports. They rotate so swiftly here, and Evo's Legends they are trying to find compensation. And yeah, Keyboy, he's all right right now. Wow, he's actually able to bait in so much. What? Keyboy, he's actually baiting in Sutsujin. You can take the kill, but Kyrie took away the purple buff. CW jumps in with a blazing duet. Keyboy, my goodness, that was a beautiful play. And look at the base on the esports. A beautifully crafted play as Taz jumps in with the way of the dragon. Taz now caught Kyrie dishing the damage onto him with the lethal counter. What? One thing that is interesting is actually Valman. He hasn't picked up any item. Only what's off camera? Such a Jin gets picked off again. What? Was that a solo kill by Boots? 2v1 too. Oh. Just to add salt. Once again, like you mentioned here, already pressuring that top side, getting a turret, getting the buff as well, and Tichijin not being able to get anything on the board. We do still see a cross play though. Will Evo's Legends be out be able to make it out alive here? Clover? Oh, he gets cancelled oh out, Boots! Sans with the flank, Clover sandwiched, and the Numen on blast by Keyboy comes in. Say goodbye to Clover. He's taken out, no goal laner. And they're playing it very, very well right now to manipulate the waves for the Lord to actually go for that top side base turret. Look at Sutsu Jin. He's all the way in the bottom side as Evo's Legends try to look for the defense. Taunt jumps in with the Jeet Kune Do. The Pendragon is able to go for the taunt. Not enough though, as the Blooms was able to dish out so much. Sans falling though will mean that Evo's Legends have the man advantage. On Esports forced to back up, not able to pick up any of the base turrets. You see the highest damage dealt by Axe, but oh my oh god, god Tutsu Jin nearly gets taken down. But yeah, back to my point. Uh, Sans has the highest amount of damage right now in this game with the Glowing Wand and the Ice Queen Wand as well. So if they want to go for those fights, try not to group because you don't feel that damage, but suddenly you're dead because of that overtime burst capacity that the Lilia can deal. Very, very good itemization there from Sans himself. And on the eSports. Tutsu Jin? Oh, he is able to get the purple. Oh, what cost? cost? Costs him his life. On CW, just with the basic attacks, imagine what the Blazing Duet is going to do once on Esports pull on that trigger. Have to wait and see here, folks, with the Lord push again. With this gold gap, I gotta say, on Evos Legends, they uh, with the very low wave clear. They can't really clear, so Onik Esports, they need to exploit that fact. Oh, the taunt though, CW able to go for the PMI, but Taz is gonna get the Wave of Dragon. Good enough last pop into the back lines, and so Tsujin is able to find a depth of plays onto two members, and this might be it right here, as Boots goes in again, has the Immortality, one for two trade for now. Onik Esports still, I mean that. That's 11,000 more damage or defense. Evo's Legends trying their best to defend. It's all gonna come down to Clover. Is he gonna be able to make the dream work? Keyboy with the Numenon Blast actually misses it out, but look at the base, instantly targeted down. Kyrie going for it, Keyboy as well. They are not even gonna go for the 